All right, game number two, live chat. How are we feeling? All right, before we get this started, make sure you guys go check out a video on my other channel. We looked at the craziest TikTok houses. It's crazy. It's a dope video. I think you guys will like it. Okay, now I have a lot to say on this. First of all, I want to say I lost money. Um, I bet a few hundred dollars, not a lot, like three, I think I bet $300 that the Bucks would win this game and they lost. Um, now there are a few things that I noticed while watching this game that has really changed the way that I viewed the Bucks. Um, so let's get it started and we can talk about those things. Let's Number one, really the Heat might win this series. I'm not George going to say the Heat shooting, will win this series after one game. I'm not going to say this. But before this game, I didn't think the Heat had an actual chance at winning the series. But the, but the Heat have an actual chance at winning the series. The Heat on the lowest of keys have a better team than the Bucks. On the lowest of keys. The Bucks have a better record. They have Giannis. You know what I mean? But when you really look at their 10 best players, it's, it's low-key better. We could go matchup by matchup. I'm, I'm, I, you know what I mean? We could go back. We got Dragic, but you mean Bam, Hero, Crowd. We could go matchup by matchup. Like, you know what I mean? Like, they, they, they low-key got, they low-key got a squad. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna go. This is gonna go six or seven games, I think, for sure. I'd be surprised if it went anything other than six or seven. I'd be surprised if this went anything other than six or seven. Now, I guess we should talk about what I was talking about in the title of this video. Um, James Harden is better than Giannis. And that's just where I'm at. Um, I watched Giannis play in this game. I was talking about it with some of my friends. If you didn't see this game, then maybe you should watch the next one. But basically, the and I don't know why Marvin Williams is playing so much. <laughs> but basically, the league sort of figured out if you can get if you can stop Giannis from going to the hole, there's really not a lot he can do. If you've just joined us for our when his when his jump when the jumper's not falling. Now when his jumper is falling, that's a different story. But it normally doesn't fall. You know what I mean? Sometimes he can get it hot, but today was not one of those times. He couldn't get any jumpers to fall. He couldn't even make any free throws. He missed like 10 free throws. That's 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 one of the main reasons why they lost this game. It's like when you, when you can stop him from doing something other than that. Other than that Tight rope on the baseline. He can't really Williams. do anything. And when he can't do anything, then the Bucks rely on Corver or Middleton. That's who they go to. Corver or Middleton. And I and I, I didn't watch the whole game, but I seen it third and the fourth quarter. They brought Corver in. They tried to give it to Corver literally. They gave it to him like three or four plays in a row. They gave it to him like three or four plays in a row. Like they would they they needed him so bad because Giannis couldn't make shit. I see them trying to do the same thing with Chris Middleton at the end of the fourth quarter. They try to give it to Middleton like three or four times in a row. And when and with Corver and Corver was making some shots, Middleton wasn't really making anything. But when Middleton or Corver is sort of like can't be hot, it, they're tough. Like they need the Bucks need Middleton to be hot for them to win. If he's not knocking down jumpers, if he can't give them twenty plus, it's hard. It's hard for the Bucks to win, man. Like low key. They're not as good of a team as they as 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 their record makes them look. Honestly, like they're, they're very beatable. Like they're beatable. I have I'm, I'm having serious doubts. Before I had the, I had the Bucks in the finals. I had the Bucks in the finals. For Turner Sports and Wednesday would have been. And I'm not ready to change on that yet. Like I said, I'm not ready to say the Heat are gonna win, but certainly a great coach, but. The Bucks the look worse to me in this game. By the way, free throw shooting numbers you saw there, Yanni's than I thought they were. The and I didn't watch. I didn't watch the whole game. In fact, I didn't even watch the first half. I watched the second half though. But what I seen in the second half was twenty-two per game. Was right in Butler's chest. Was not impressive. Well, you're not going to back West Matthews down very easily. 
He is a very mm. specific Oh my god. Oh my god. Has the oh my the lord. We just go not talk about him just yeah. just putting Crowder on his ass right there. We just not gonna <laughs> We just not gonna talk about that. Huh? Word, 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 word. For sure, for sure, for sure, for sure. For sure, for sure. But yeah, that's why I say James Harden is better, man. Diagnosis was late to arrive, had to leave again. James Harden has no defense. I understand that. He doesn't get rebounds. He doesn't get blocks. I understand all of that. I'm aware of the things that Giannis does better than James Harden. I'm aware of that. But but none hits nonetheless. Giannis's offense. <laughs> It's like one of the worst parts about this game, low key. <laughs> the only nice thing about his offense is his driving, which is all just because of his size and strength. Like, if he didn't have that size or that strength, then the same moves he does wouldn't even work. Both of these teams want to protect the paint at all costs, as we see right here, and threes are going to be open. Crowder, not that time. He's really, he's really like a power forward. For, <laughs> nah, I'm on his ass. I'm off that. I'm off that. I'm off that. I'm off that. I'm off. That. I'm, off that. I'm really not trying to tear you out as a party like that. But turning the clock back, he's been a 20-point score in his career multiple times. As Yanis, I just, I don't know. I don't know. I didn't love what I saw. 19 in the first half. Rises and Shout out to Bam for getting me my double double. Milwaukee Bucks have led by I was looking at Bam stats. I'm like, oh yeah, he for sure gonna get this double double game Butler one, of course. Open. Easy Kennedy. money. And we are and he tied. did. I knew it. Bam, damn, they're gonna get a double double every game. Talking okay. about October Butler, vicious. So yeah, I guess now we can talk about Jimmy Butler. Wow, I wasn't expecting Jimmy Butler to come out here and do this. I wasn't expecting Jimmy, Jimmy Butler to come out here and do this. The Heat have a really good chance at winning this series. And maybe making it to the finals. Who knows? It's possible. Jimmy Butler is really good. And when I say that Giannis's offense is not that good, compared to Jimmy Butler. We all say that Giannis is better than Jimmy Butler, right? That's what we all say, right? But Jimmy Butler's offense is better, though. He can, he can do more on offense. Giannis not being able to do that much on offense is killer. It's killer. He out there running around setting all these damn screens and shit because he can't because he can't cross nobody and hit a jumper. You know what I mean? Like. He, he, he doing all this, just work on all of this other nigga, work on your fadeaway, nigga, get a fadeaway jumper. You know what I mean? Like, where is the, like, where is the, what do y'all, like, progress the shot? What the hell? You know, so much of the talk about Miami has been how great their young players are, and they are. I need to perfect the shot and the dribbles on this little big ass, man. got it. Butler was out here going crazy on y'all niggas. Well, that's what you've got to do with Jimmy Butler. You've got to make him make shots over the top. They had nobody to, nobody to guard it. Going full extension, and he's fouled. And I wanted the Bucks to win this, too. I was rooting for him. I had money on the line, man. Damn. Giannis again on the take, banks it in. I don't know how that's not a foul. He's got 18 points. You can finish that play. I'm getting Butler mad all over. I'm losing. It feels like I'm losing my money all over again. Man. <laughs> 27 points to lead all scores. Jimmy Butler, you should know. Whenever a player that normally isn't that scruffy come out there looking like that, it's it's, it's you, 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 should, you should know you in for some hoops. He's he not he not he not even getting haircuts. Jimmy not even getting haircuts. He's not getting haircuts. He's not getting his mustache trimmed. He looked like, he looked like 2016, 2017 OSN. Like, he, he, you know what I mean? That's how you know he locked in. When a nigga come in looking like that, you know that nigga locked in. Because only locked in niggas look like that. <laughs> you got to be so locked in to not care that you out there looking that. Because he out there looking crazy. Don't get it twisted. Butler was out there looking like a K. Look at his little stupid ass. He look crazy. <laughs> He look wild, but he getting money though. He getting money though. He getting. They got nobody to guard him. He, woo, he was. Yeah, he, he cocked him by himself. Won it by himself. Won it by himself. Giannis can't make a jumper. Middleton can't make a jumper. What the hell? Nice game. What the hell? Great tip, Bam. Hustle play. Huge three. Huge three. 
That took the life out of me. It took the life out of me. I was pissed when you hit that, Tyler. Not gonna lie to you. <laughs> and I knew he was gonna hit that. Just the way I be losing all of my money, I, I knew he was gonna hit that. I'm like, he gonna, he gonna make this watch, and he silked it. I'm like, yep, take out my money. <laughs> that's how, that's where, that's how they always do it. That's how it always feels. Like I knew the feeling before he even rose up for the jumper. I had already felt the feeling that he was gonna knock it. And just, yep. That's tough. will lose game one. That's tough. Milwaukee looking crazy right now. They gotta figure it out because they could lose this series. I'm not ready to say they will, but they might. Anyways, that's gonna do it. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Go watch that uh, TikTok houses video on my other channel. Leave all your comments about this below. But yeah, like I said, until further notice, I gotta go with James Harden over Giannis. Like Giannis, he can't do it. He can't really do anything on offense, man. Like he got no no jumper just a, it's just like a little stand. I mean he can make it standing but that just just the way he has to be so central to shoot it is you know what I mean like I don't know I don't know Jimmy was looking crazy out there seen MB fat ass tweeting about it nigga stop living in the past you on the week at sixes nigga you got Simmons nigga <laughs> but yeah man I'm out of here man I'm taking it easy man peace